Okay? So the second problem is ice ice baby. Find the fraction of the volume of the iceberg that is below sea level. So alam natin ice floats on water, but the question is what um, is the percentage of the ice that is um, partially immersed um, in water? So uh, we are assuming that this is seawater kasi nga iceberg yan. Uh, so the density of iceberg is known. The density of seawater is, is also known. What ang question lang is ano yung volume na magsasubmerge sa kanya. Okay. So I'll be giving you maybe a minute to solve this problem and I'll show you the solution after. Okay, so two minutes have elapsed. Maybe we can solve this problem. So the question now is what is the fraction of the volume of the iceberg that's below sea level? Um let's assume uh uh let's see that the, the total volume of um, the iceberg is, let's say, the ice and the volume submerged, the volume submerged is, this is V sub, okay? Nakuha? Okay, sige. Now, by Newton's second law, so pwede mong isipin, meron, um, of course, this is a really dramatic picture. So we have a, uh, uh, an iceberg there that is floating um, on water. Now, uh, the question now is, what is this volume here? This is denoted by V sub. Okay, that's your V sub. So hanggang dito lang sa point na to. Tapos itong total, ano na to, that's your V ice. Okay, so just for notation. Okay, so using Newton's second law, by Newton's second law, The observation of forces acting on Y is zero, which is just equal to what? What are the forces acting on this um on this iceberg here? Siyempre, may weight yan. Tsaka, ano pa? Buoyant force. Yes, there should be a buoyant force pointing upward. This is FB minus um, a weight pointing downward minus MG. Okay, let's say M is the total mass of the of the of the iceberg. Now. Remember, so I'll just write it as mass ice um, times G. Um, this just means that the total buoyant force is equal to the mass of ice times the acceleration due to gravity. And uh, we know that the buoyant force, but the buoyant force is just equal to density of the, of in that case, seawater, um, volume of the submerged times G. Or I should say volume ng seawater na displaced. But we know that uh, this is simply density of seawater, volume of the submerged part times G. Again, yung submerged lang yung importante. Hindi naman kasi nakalubog itong top part na to, therefore, ito lang kailangan mong gamitin. Okay? Gets? Gets yung part na yun? Yes, sir. Yeah, v submerged, hindi yan VIs. Okay. So this just this implies that the density of seawater, volume of sea, of the submerged object times G is simply mass of ice times G. But what is the mass of ice? How is it related to the density of ice? This is just equal to what? Density multiplied by the volume. Yes, this is just therefore multiplied density of ice multiplied by the volume of ice times G. Tama? Hence, the Gs here will cancel. And therefore, I can write this now as density of seawater over density of ice. Uh, pagpalitin ko. Uh, volume sub over volume of ice is equal to the density of ice over the density of seawater. Okay? Now, this, these two volumes here, the ratio of them is just the fraction of the volume that is uh, that is immersed in the in the seawater. Hence, ito na hinahanap natin. So this is just, hence, this is just basically the ratio of the density of the iceberg over the density of seawater, di ba? Eh, di, but what's the density of iceberg? This is 0.92 times 10 to the 3 kilograms per cubic meter divided by 1.025 times 10 to the 3 kilograms per cubic meter the, of course, this will cancel, and therefore the ratio of um, the submerged part over ice is just equal to 0.897. Okay, so about um, only about one tenth of the ice that we will, that we are seeing is floating in water. The other nine tenths is um is partially immersed. 
uh, in water. Okay? Nakuha? Kuha to? Yes, yes sir. Okay, that's basically the point of this exercise. Na hindi lahat ng ice, while it is floating on water, only part of it is float is um is observed or is seen uh, above water. The other, in fact, majority of the ice is at the bottom of of the water. So that's about 0.897. Uh, that's the fraction, or I should say the uh the part of the of the ice that is um uh, that is immersed in sea water. Okay, questions? May tanong? Wala? Wala. Okay. 